All right. Yeah, tell me, what are you smelling here? Here's a really flat one. What do these smell like? Okay. So you guys, do you have to get the general picture of how we would grade the beans now? Okay, right. that one was Why so easy for me. I don't have any other okay. body spray. Okay, spotting and support issues going on. Great, that's a critical one as we go through and solve problems today. such a positive and great way that I can't even put into words like how great of an experience it was. And I would say that definitely you should work as hard as you can in the application to try to get in because this is a once in a lifetime experience and I'm so grateful that I got a chance to, to use it. I knew that this was going to change me, but the people here are so much more beautiful than you can imagine and so much more welcoming than you could have imagined. And so that really surprised me and really shocked me more than I thought that it would. And just, they don't know a stranger here, and so that was really impactful. And I guess it just really opened my eyes to, um, it just really confirmed what I want to do. You know, I can't, I can't hardly remember last week. This, uh, this whole process, this whole experience has been absolutely life-changing. You know, uh, I guess last week I was just a kid uh, not sure what he was going to do in school or what he planned on doing his career, but now I'm pretty, I know, I think I know exactly what I want to do. There hasn't been a moment, even, even the slightest moment that uh, I felt like, oh, I can't wait for this to get over or I'd rather not do this. I mean, even, even the cold showers aren't bad, so. A week ago, I would have never expected to like the food or like living in Africa because I'm used to my TV, my iPod, my computer all the time and just pretty much a spoiled American kid. But now it's like this is so much easier, simple life and I love it here. I'm a picky eater but I love the food. It's natural, it's no preservatives, it's amazing and I love the people and that's another thing I didn't expect. I expected it to be so much of a difference between us that the gap between us could never be filled. And now I'm like, I feel part of this community now. I feel like I'm a completely different person. I feel like there's things I wasn't sure about myself. And it's kind of unexplainable, but I feel a little bit stronger about who I am. And there, 
I kind of figuring out more of what I kind of want to do. I want to help others. And this is an op this opportunity has helped me realize that I can do a lot. For me, I would not be as much of a person as I am today if it wasn't for this program. And that seems like a rather large statement to make. But I have more confidence than I've ever had before about the fate of the human race. We, these, these students have shown me that it doesn't matter what um, challenge you face, you can always, through community, be much stronger than you are alone. I don't think you can come here and come away from this and be completely the same person because you just, there are no people like the people here in Tanzania. They're just so kind and selfless. They're like the most selfless people I've ever met and um, they're really strong and they have this inner fire, this like spirit that you don't see in everyone. Last week I was this person that had this persona of people in Africa to be hopeless and just stuff that you saw on commercials about how pitiful and life here was just so hard. But once we got here and we saw these people's faces that just is nothing like that they're perceived on commercials. They're just so welcoming and so lively and joyous and they just enjoy hanging out with people and they don't really pity themselves for the life that they have and it's just not like anything that I would think before I came here. And I was just, it's been so life changing. I just, I don't want to go home. <laughs> it's been an amazing experience and you got to do things that you'll never be able to do. I mean, you may be able to come to Africa on a safari or a mission trip or something like that, but just the opportunities that's been given to us when we were here, being able to visit the school, we visited a hospital, we visited another school that's being built with the mayor. You get welcomed as if you're nobility from a country. It's just amazing how welcoming they really are and how sweet the people are. And the fact that we got to help Sean also and the cocoa and the business aspect of it, which most people wouldn't be able to do, was, the, was a really cool part of it too and meet with his farmers. Well, the interesting thing about what we've been doing, well, what the kids have been doing, is it's work. And these kids are not tourists in Tanzania. They're actually here working and they're working on computers, they're working with wiring so that we can power the, all of the classrooms for laptops, and they've been working measuring height and weight and, and uh, working bagging rice with Moya students, um, talking with them, laughing with them, and really developing relationships. And it's almost magical to watch them transform over the time that they're here and how much of an impact that this has on their lives. And when, it, when I first saw this, I almost didn't believe it because I don't even really understand how it, how it works. I, it's just that they're exposed to this culture and to these people and to their hospitality and their friendship and their love and it just does something to people, not just the kids but the adults and all of us. I say to students who are, are thinking about this in the back of their mind and if they're really on the fence about what they want to do with their lives or how they want to make their lives richer before they go to college, help them make decisions about what they want to do in life. Maybe they don't want to graduate from college and live in Africa for the rest of their lives, but maybe they want to find a way to serve people, to serve people in America, to serve people in their community. And there's something about this trip that lights that spark and that gives people inspiration and imagination about what they can do and give their life meaning in the future. Ha, 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 ha.